Hi everyone and welcome back to another Speed Build Sunday. So for this one, I did <laughs> sorry. Um I guess that's a lesson for me not to drink uh, vodka before doing this. Hey, things you learn, right? Uh, but yeah, um, <laughs> oh my god, okay. Um, yeah, but no, I did this during a live stream, as you guys can see the chat in the um, upper right uh, section there. I don't know what to call it. My mind isn't working. That is just on tiredness, not the vodka. <laughs> tiredness and vodka, not a good combination, eh? Um, but yeah, no, I had noticed that I really liked townhouse builds. And, like, you would see, like, you know, these big YouTubers teaming up with their other big YouTuber friends uh, about, um, and, you know, they would, you know, each do a section of the house. And I'm like, well, why don't I just do a small, like, you guys can't see if I do, like, the figure quotes around small, um, uh, ta uh, ta uh, townhouse? Yeah, I call it a townhouse. <laughs> um, and so it's just, uh, three houses, so, like, three different families would live in there, and they're all roughly the same on the inside, like, walls and everything, uh, but I did decorate it and design it, di like, each one differently, so the first one you'll see is sort of like a, um, turn of the century modern, um, and then the middle one is a very modern, like, black and white kind of style, um, tile floors, things like that. And then the last one is probably my favorite, it's a boho house, which I honestly think we all love that one simply because it's a boho house and it's like so colorful and everything. Oh, I just had so much fun with that one. But yeah, so uh, this is the first one. This one is the um, turn of the century or mid-century modern. I don't know what the correct term for that is. Um, so originally I was going to do like each floor by itself. But then I realized it would just be easier to do each house by itself. So that is what I actually ended up doing. Uh, you could, you could have, you would have seen um, me putting in like the floors and everything beforehand. And <clears throat> I don't know if I've already done it or if I will do it in the future. But I'll change the floors around to uh, better fit the um, style. <laughs> uh, so yeah, so. I don't know, it was just something, like, this house here was very, it's you. It's what I would normally do in the way of styles, and that's just me trying to figure out which kind of uh, counter to use. Uh, thank you, chat. I love having the chat there, and if uh, you guys want to help me, I am working on another speed build, so <laughs> uh, check out my live streams, you know. <laughs> Uh, but, um, oh yeah, and then, try, oh, trying to figure out a table for he this area. Oh, I think I moved the table, like, five times before I settled on the spot. <laughs> oh, that's fun. <clears throat> that was fun. And then this is just me, like, trying to figure out the living room arrangement and everything. Like, you could see my frustration. Like, you can't hear it, but you can see it, because I keep moving everything all over the place. And it's actually funny because I was going back through the house after I had finished it, like, going through, like, each room and everything in, uh, tap mode. And I'm like, oh yeah, I forgot about this. Oh yeah, I forgot about that because it's, like, some of this stuff I had done, like, a month ago. Like, I just finished this up recently and it's taken me a while to, uh, edit it all down. Which, by the way, I... The way I render these videos is I do it uh, five times the speed, and then normally I take, I, then I render that, and then I double that. So I guess you could really say it's ten times the speed of what it would normally be, um, but it's 
I don't know how, how you would explain it. It's it's it t it's not really ten times the speed, but you could, I guess, make the point that it is ten times the speed. Um, for this one, however, because it was four videos and they were all about two hours that made up about eight hours of footage, even with stuff taken out. Um, and so I rendered it and went to about five times the speed and even when I did um, render that and then speed it up again I still had to go to five times the speed <laughs> so I had I did five times the speed render and then what you're seeing here is that sped up again five times so yeah it's moving pretty fast but that was the only way I could get it down so that it was a reasonable length because if I had just doubled it, it would have been half an hour. The video alone. That's not counting my intro. That's not counting the pictures. That's not counting the outro. Just the video alone would have been about half hour. And I don't know about you guys, but I don't like talking that much. At least for that length, anyway. Uh, cause you know my uh, throat dries out and everything. So. Um, yeah, I, uh, didn't bother with, uh, putting in the, um, making it half, a half hour long video, so I rendered it until it was just under 20 minutes. Oh, that's, that's fun right there. That's fun. But, um, yeah, so this would be the second live stream, and we got cat cam going there. That cat is a pain in the butt. <laughs> I love him, but he's a pain in the butt. Um, but, uh, yeah. And then I guess I'm working on the front. <laughs> I stopped to give attention to the cat. The cat that I don't like. Well, I like him, but he's a giant butt pain, so. Oh, you know, I never did actually fill up that area. Like, you can see me doing something there and it's just like, no, I don't like it. So I actually get rid of all of that. Um, and I think I just ended up putting mailboxes there and that's it. So that's actually kind of interesting. Now that's the bottom floor, right? Yes. Okay. So, um, it's not a basement down there. It's an actual floor, like you might have seen it. So it's, um... It's the, like, main, f it would normally be the main floor, but you actually go up the stairs, so you come through on the quote-unquote sec second floor, and then it has the third floor, which is the second floor of the house, if that makes sense. Um, I think apart from the middle house, each one has about four bedrooms. I think the middle one only has three because I actually took one of the bedrooms that's upstairs and turned it into an office space um but I mean I think it can be turned back into a bedroom fairly easily um something I actually found really interesting and you'll see it once I get to the middle house uh is that I actually use the pre-made rooms and bring the stuff out of that and put it into the bedroom and I actually like that I I think what happened was I was running out of time in the stream and I'm just like, well, let's just do this and this and this and it worked. <laughs> and here's me actually trying to fill up the room in a way that made sense. So it is a kid's room and I'm just like, okay, well, what would a kid's room have? So, you know, I put in, you know, the dollhouse. I put in, I think I put in a bear. I'm not sure. I have the toy chest. There's me again having trouble with that table. Um, am I on the middle house now? I'm on the middle house now. But yeah, so the kids room and the toddlers room, I actually really like it. It's just, I don't know, it was something different, especially with what I did with the walls. I'm moving my hands like you guys can see it. <laughs> like you guys can see me. But um, yeah, so I, as you can see, I, like, I did one wall as like a featured wall. And then just sort of like playing colored for the rest. And I really like that. I think it made the room stand out a bit more. Uh, and then so that room you saw just there like with the uh, blue wall. That's a um, office space. So, And then this is what I was going to tell you guys earlier. Is I took um, 
the stuff out of the room and then put it in there and I just kind of like plopped it down and then I think I moved it around later. I was going to move that bed, I think originally, and I never did. I think I just left it there and I'm just like, I should have moved that. <laughs> um, but I left it there. You're like, even in the pictures, you'll see it's still there. It's in a very odd spot, but I like it there for some reason. <laughs> um, but yeah, no, I, I, I definitely think the bo the boho house is my favorite, but I gotta admit, there's a lot of stuff I did with these houses because I had to sort of think out of my natural way because I wanted everything to feel different. I didn't want them to all feel like the same cookie cutter house, even though they were like all the walls are in the same place, more or less. So that in and of itself is cookie cutter, but the interior is very different. You see, th you can clearly see three different styles for each of the house. Like when the pictures come and I'll show you like the, the uh, bird's eye view of it, or like the floor layer or whatever you want to call it. You can see that it's three different families living here, not one giant family that spread out across three houses kind of thing, which was my goal for this. Like I went in thinking, I want this house to be different. Like the each family is different and I got it I'm just happy with it and I think I've sort of carried that idea over to this new one I'm working on for or um on my live stream um I'm, I'm gonna try and do that more often actually like try to do different things I'm, I'm watching I've gone back to watching a lot of um Uh, speed builds, but I'm not watching the people I normally watch. I'm watching different people that really go all out in their builds. Like, um, this one person, uh, I think they used a mod, I'm not sure, but I think they used a mod. But they created like Hogwarts, and I watched how they like use different things in a way that I wouldn't have thought of before. So, you know, things like that, and that's a great way to get inspiration. and. Um, if this is what I'm doing. It's a Victorian style house, but all I, no, I did actually look at the floor plans, but I had to change the floor plan, but it's a very, like, it's a Victorian house on the outside, but I'm making it its own on the inside, basically. And then, yeah, see, so there's me again using the rooms because I liked it. You know, going for that, it had this sort of, like, catalog feel to it and that's actually I think was what I was going for for this one you know it, it's supposed to look like it's been brought out of a cat cat catalog there we go so yeah the middle house I don't know it's just it like each house is very different and I really do like it and let me know in the comments down below which one is your favorite the mid-century modern or boho like I said, mine is boho. It's very colorful. A lot of people in the chat seem to like the boho one too. So, uh, but if you like the modern one, you know, hey, awesome, you like the modern one. You know, just let me know which one you like. <laughs> um, yeah. <laughs> um, actually, it's kind of funny. I've been meaning to do this voiceover all week. Like, I think I finished up this house on Monday, last Monday. Um, which also I had my final on Monday, so, no, did I do it on, no, I think it was Wednesday, because I don't think I streamed on Monday, so it must have been Wednesday that I did the last, uh, video for it. Um, I didn't do a live stream on Monday, because I had done a seven hour live stream the day before, and I was still recovering. No. Yeah, yeah, I did a seven hour live stream on that Sunday, so, um. Yeah, in, in, instead of studying for my final, I did a seven hour live stream. I had actually studied beforehand, but um, yeah, I didn't think the game would take seven hours. I think that was mostly because I died 62 times. I uh, just did the count for that uh, earlier today as well. So um, yeah, leaving everything to the last minute. And I'm going home this weekend too for the summer. So that's like five months for me, by the way, because I'm not back in school until September. Okay. Um, 
Oh yeah, I have some custom content, uh, <laughs> uh, custom content, um, wall art. And that little footage there was me showing everyone my room because it was empty. So it was probably on Wednesday that I did the last part which you guys are seeing now. So yeah, so I just finished this and... Oh, oh yeah, so the reason my room's empty. One, like I said, I'm heading back home for the summer. And two, my cousin and I just swapped rooms. And let me tell you, getting my bed, my bed frame, I should say, my bed frame out of my room and into the new one. Oh, that was fun. That was fun. <laughs> no, it was like, we had a hard time getting it through the door. And then we found out that just flipping it, like, it was on the one side. So the um, headboard was facing, like, to the right. And so we flipped it so that the headboard was facing the left. And that's how we got it in. Like, it was just that easy to get it in. But we couldn't, We it took us, like, half hour, I think, to figure that out. So, hey, you know what? By the way, I love the Wonder Woman thing on the wall there. Very nice, EA. Very nice. We all love the Wonder Woman. Or, uh, what was it? Wonder Woman? I think that was what someone said. It was Wonder Woman. Uh, and then we start, all started talking about, uh, about like, Greek, uh, Greek, German. <laughs> oh, my gosh. <laughs> oh, that's kind of funny. Um, but yeah. Um, but yeah, so now I am in a different bedroom. Um, she gave me the large one because I do have more stuff. And it's just giving me a lot more space to move my stuff around. And I actually like the layout of my room a lot more right now. Still have the coffee maker in my room because that's just how I am. Though I still I have a vodka in front of me. Like, <laughs> uh, I don't drink very often, by the way. <laughs> um, but uh, yeah, summer break. Awesome. Now, not all of you will be in summer break, but what are your plans for over the summer? Do you know, are you gonna be, you know, going or traveling? Are you maybe taking summer courses for school or whatnot? You know, let me know. For me, I'm writing all summer. That's my goal. <laughs> um, but my little line is getting near the end, so I am going to end this off here. I want to thank you all for watching this video. It always means a lot to me. And I... <laughs> That's my uh, Twitch outro. <laughs> uh, thank you all for watching this video. I hope you've all enjoyed it. If you have, please hit that subscribe button and notification button to stay up to date with all the videos that I post. And I will see you all tomorrow. Bye, everyone.